Another episode of Socratic Gamers here again with Arvel Riv Asensio, aka uh, Dawn of York Strong, 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 Strong. Strong. Yep. <laughs> and uh, yeah, so um, tell me, Arvel, what's it like being a YouTuber? A YouTuber, Dawn. Um, so one thing that I noticed and it's actually kind of exciting is getting like uh residents coming up to me who are not from stong mm -hmm. go 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 pick up some yeah i'm trying to i don't know how to get out of this uh we would turn around and yeah. we'd exit through the main door into the garage where's that right there main door main door to your left this yes <laughs> exit garage enter garage enter garage Sweet. Okay, cool. So you're saying, what's it like being a YouTuber at York University? Uh, and it's hashtag sad turnips. Hashtag sad turnips. Turn it up. Turn it up. Do, 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 do. Shout out to BJ for the for the for the sticker, sticker design. Am I getting the bike again? Yeah, I get the bike. Oh man, I hate the bike. All right. So uh, yeah, tell me what, what's it like being a YouTuber? Um, I love it. I love being a YouTuber at York, and um. The uh, the publicity is actually getting pretty big. Nice. I, I hit 193. Wow, yeah, that's yeah. really good. 193 how, now. How fast did that cat uh, get you? Because I remember when you were telling me, you're like, oh, I, I got a bunch more um, um, subscribers and stuff. Like, how long did it take you to get 193? How long did it take? Um, I'd say uh, two, two months. I know it's been up since uh, uh, August, but I don't really... I don't really count the um, the first month because mm -hmm. that was just like family. Yeah, yeah. And then when I got into school, uh, it blew up. Hold on, quick, quick pause. Press. Yeah, I'm, I was I was like I need Start. to get to the map. Uh, map, right there. X. Yep. Go down, 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 down. down. You'll see a uh, interesting. There it is. Good. Okay. Cool. And we'll do one one resupply. Because I gotta bounce. Yes. So, uh, yeah, you were saying so. Um, so you really blew up within two months. Yeah, two months it started blowing up, and I think right after the um, we have these stickers printed out. Yeah. Uh, I feel like because because the plan is um, to spread it all over the other residences. Nice, nice. So so far, it's only been exposed to basically like my floors. Uh huh. Yeah. And then with a little bit of publicity coming from my window because I put the I put sad turnips on my window. Yeah. Yeah. Um, other than that, I really think because like uh, people on my floor, uh huh, uh, like my residents told uh -huh. me that uh, they'll they'll make a little team for sad turnips. Nice. Oh, that's cool. And then with those with those um with those stickers, they'll just they'll just go on each floor. Awesome. Oh, I missed a turn. Go on each floor and then just throw a slide underneath everyone's door. Cool. Let, let, all right, let's talk about some uh, marketing tactics. So you said you put. Actually, wait, no. Before we talk about that, uh, do you consider yourself a YouTuber? Um, see, that's a that's the that's the crazy thing. Um, and when do you consider like if you don't, when do you consider yourself a YouTuber? Uh, you know, before with YouTube, right? Because I yeah. watched Casey Neistat. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw Casey Neistat. Shout out to Casey Neistat. Casey. That guy's sick. Shout out to Casey Neistat. Uh, copying out his setup, yo. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> um, but yeah, uh, when I when I saw when I watched Casey and I said, right, I think okay, YouTuber, um, YouTubers are just like these people that make videos and everything like that. Uh -huh. uh, they get all these views, but they're just really like living. And I realize that now that um, a YouTuber is like specifically uh, vloggers. Press all circle. Their, circle. Cool. Yeah. Uh, specifically vloggers, all they do is just like. They just they just video their life and then they, and they share it. Yeah, right? for sure. And um, that's where my idea of like a YouTuber was like, uh, oh shit! Like I I guess I am a YouTuber after people started saying, oh shit, you're the YouTuber for Tad Turnips. Ah, yeah, yeah exactly. Like, nice, nice. That's I, very it hit cool. me because I was like, oh man, yeah, yeah, I am a YouTuber for sure, for sure. Yeah. It, so it, it's it's interesting because like you you didn't set up it it always. It, like if it comes authentically and organically, it always seems to happen like that. You don't actually consider yourself it until you're told like, oh, you are it. Yeah. And, you know, which is which is interesting. Yeah. Because and then and then once you get to that point, because now like, um, it's the whole fanboy thing, right? Yeah, it's not yeah. there anymore. It's like, oh, you're just another. We're just we're just videoing ourselves, and people are enjoying. For sure. Yeah. yeah exactly. You, That's you, it. You pierce you pierce the veil of like. Uh, illusion and yeah. you realize like okay these are just people literally with the same setup i have that's it and they're just editing yeah that's it you know? but but see like so i find like um 
so I've, I've recently transitioned transition from being like web designer mm-hmm. like that, that was like because i was like oh let me get a job let me just call myself a web designer to like blogger and like i was looking at mm. my my own stuff and like i do write a lot but i find that in like being a youtuber or being a blogger it forces you to live life because it's like what content do i have you know yeah that's you, true that's your another job one. right your job ultimately becomes like living at that yep. point you know so do, just do, straight living man yeah right that's why sure. i put don living that's cool that's cool. which is which isn't actually the reason i just i just thought of the name which is why like it, it's also kind of blowing my mind where it's like oh this is happening and it's just coming into place you know for sure like um the dawn life like uh becoming a dawn i was on the waiting list and all that stuff and then uh-huh. i got the job i'm like oh sick and then i realized like after i was videoing everything like as i video i have something to do every day and i'm like oh man because i'm a dawn i have content exactly yeah, yeah your yeah. life becomes content you know that's and it. like and so like uh yeah, yeah, made it. but it's funny because it's like if we all just kind of like highlighted our day yeah it's like we today we walk through a um, farmer's market mm-hmm. right and like how many people walk through farmer's markets how many people go to like best buy how many people like do all these things but like they're not promoted in a specific way so like people think that their lives are very boring mm-hmm. but it's like no your life is very exciting you're just not thinking of it as exciting yeah but because you're <clears throat> watching me youtube it it makes you you know you, and that adds on to uh how a lot I've, I've had maybe four residents now uh-huh. come up to me like you make me want to make videos i'm like you could totally really? make videos yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. See, but, like exactly. your videos make me want to make videos and i'm there like you, you could do it yeah. this is the thing but see see it's like you didn't you didn't set out to like spark people you were just doing it for yourself and then it was like the people that wanted to know yeah came towards you right there was no like no pushing yeah so all right, not let trying me... to fix anything you know <laughs> no force no force just just let it let it happen no force to fix what am i so, doing never be supplies supply, yeah. uh steel supplies steel supplies so uh i mean even with this like these these quote podcasts unquote are just really conversations yeah in front of us playing video games right now but then it's like oh dude i want to be a podcaster it's like of course you could like, yeah you know just do it and just do it you know um and then uh it's just like the oh, press B. Yeah, 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 yeah oh you mean oh yeah shout out to not xbox yeah all right good to hear you saying <laughs> um it's the uh because i have a i have a friend right now yeah. who wants to do youtube uh-huh. but they know that it's just their fear that's holding them back they said i'm oh, too scared interesting yeah they, they're aware of it uh-huh. and all they want to do is just make videos i'm like wait why do you want to make videos because i just want to like video myself working out and stuff he wants to do he wants to do a fitness channel oh that's interesting. yeah but uh well the, there's the danger of narcissism too though that is also you know? true you also don't want to like make yourself but he wants to make fitness videos well he said like uh i, w- I plan to make fin oh Oh no. Uh, that's fine. Right. I plan to make fitness videos so that I could help people, like, show them the right everything, everything, everything. For sure, yeah, totally. Right. Uh-huh. And I'm um, like, so why don't you do it, man? And then um, he's just said, like, because, yo, I'm too scared to do it. I'm like, what are you scared oh. about? So he's, he knows he's scared, and he's just like, yo, you just need to... And this is, this is what I think what the whole YouTuber thing is. He's like, he, this is what he said. I, um, I believe that uh, a certain person has to be a YouTuber. It's your personality interesting yeah and i'm like so you're saying you don't have that personality oh shit, shit, shit. Uh-huh. do you have a gun yeah yeah you just gotta jump off uh pro- hold uh, i think it's like l1 hold l1 l1 yeah and then <clears throat> just like yeah, yeah cool i'd use that ak yep yeah. all right cool what you're saying uh yeah so he's just afraid to to show himself and i'm like dude you're perfectly fine just video yourself man and yeah for sure yeah that's literally it you know what's interesting it'll always turn out crappy in the beginning Mm because because before this was socratic gamers this was you playing uh yeah come over right yeah and you just, just like coming play, over playing and then you say like weird yeah you scream <laughs> at the thing like oh make these like weird sound effects as you're like playing the game <laughs> and then just one day i was like oh let me just like ask you questions yeah you know what i mean and like in that you know but if if you if you focused on the first bit you'd be like oh it sucks but it's like mm-hmm. no just make it better then if it sucks make it better and that's a, that's another thing uh we actually talked about this in dawnship where it's just like um focusing on perfection is what will bring you to pr- procrastination oh for sure yeah for yeah sure, just for thinking sure. about oh you got to be the best got to be the best it's like mm, nah man because you, you don't, don't even start it's not yeah exactly yeah. that and it's like because i have another person in in residence uh-huh. who who wants to be a youtuber but he just wants to make the best videos yeah oh that's and that's why i'm like so how many videos do you have out none yeah. he hasn't started yet because he's still trying to figure out like oh man 
I gotta I gotta be like the the top person. Um, and how can you? I think you gotta get in the car. And and how can you even become the best if you haven't even practiced anything? Exactly. You know. So like um so like even like with you, you just bought like uh, some stuff. Uh, hashtag don't bait out your scene. But uh, hashtag what? Um, don't bait out your scene because you're trying to keep the paper trailing and blah, blah, blah. Oh yeah. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So so anyways, you, you upgraded yourself. Yeah. Um, onto. Um, you upgrade yourself basically with like equipment stuff mm-hmm. and it's like yeah but if you hadn't even began in the first so it's like oh man i gotta be the best i gotta have like six six angles the best audio this 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 but it's like okay you all have to start off with one camera and one yeah mic, or like one you know what I mean? like, everyone does like they they disregard the uh the small stuff the small stuff yeah the, the, for sure. the first step yeah exactly exactly they think about the big picture yeah but it's like you'll never you will never mm-hmm. come out swinging ever. right away you know even like uh even like i guess it's like uh so i i've, I've said how i want to like i would love to write a book one day right but it's like i can't write the book without the blogs <clears throat> because how do you practice writing you're right. not gonna like sit down one day and be like you know i'm inspired I i'm gonna write be the 100 percent the best writer in the world you know what I mean? like it's gonna suck that's not how it works yeah all right so uh, transitioning into marketing like uh talk about your marketing techniques because they're pretty clever marketing techniques yeah so the first one was your uh, window oh okay yeah so the first thing was my window where like uh i realized that <laughs> wait so pause it's funny that you're like uh you're like marketing techniques but it's like we're all marketing yeah you just don't know that you're yeah either. it's the same thing with youtubing <laughs> right, yeah totally totally it's like oh, yeah, i'm just making videos exactly yeah so. it's almost just like yo what are some clever things to get my literally what i said is like what are some easy ways to get this publicity aka marketing right? yeah which is marketing yeah so okay you, you're saying so uh so the first thing i did was uh so i um i was in my room Uh and then i realized like i could see a lot of people and the first thing was that 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 gave me the idea was when i looked across there's another there's another residence right across from us okay smart and they're just saying hi and they had they had they had sticky notes that said hi and i was just like oh snap so when i um so the first thing i did was i just waved hi and then they responded i'm like oh that's that's fun that's cool so this is actually like working, uh-huh. um, but then when I what am I doing right now? Uh, do one more, another one. Okay. Yeah. Um, when I when I realized that like oh shit my window is is something that people can can yeah, see sure. me with. So then I was like okay what can I do? Um, I decided to put uh, sad turnips on my window. For sure. Yeah. Uh, first it actually was YT uh-huh. sad turnips, uh-huh. and then um, the first thing I did was like or I, I drew it out first. I uh-huh. was like. Um, I should make it color coded first of all because like uh, I do that in the videos. Uh-huh, yeah. And then I'm like sad, what is sad? Blue and turnip screen plant. Okay. So I put sad turnips, I'm like, okay, that's easier. And then I use the bigger the bigger sticky note so that it could be visible uh-huh. from even down below. Uh-huh. And then uh circle. Uh what am I doing? Uh you gotta do another resupply. Where's my bike? Um you gotta find it. Oh yeah, yeah uh, we left the bike. No, it's right there. Oh yeah, you probably did leave the bike. No, no, it's the down the street. See that? Right oh, there, there it is. Those. Yeah. All right, continue. Yeah. Uh, where am I supposed to head? Just in that direction. I don't see the the yellow. What? No, not yellow. You gotta get on your bike first. Okay. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. Um, so I put sad turnips on my window, mm-hmm. and then um, wait, I don't don't clack. So yeah, yeah, okay, cool. Or just hold it down. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so the first thing was putting sad turnips on a window, and that got me a little bit of publicity. And I realized it started working because people in the comment section were like, "Oh, what a clever way to no way!" Yeah, and, oh, and what what made sick. it even what made yeah. it even better was um, people from the other residents uh-huh. because of Snapchat. Uh-huh. I started seeing myself in other people's stories, yo. No way! They're like, "Who the heck put this on their window?" Say word. Yeah. So free publicity, you know. See, that's pretty smart, man. I uh, I was reading this. Um, it's called biology, like, but not like biology, like B U Y ology, biology. Okay. And it was like, um, it was my first intro, one of my first introductions to like psychology and marketing. And they were saying that like everything is kind of like a billboard, you know. So like a T-shirt, you don't realize you're a walking billboard for like yeah. Gap, you know, or like your phone, right? With the stickers, put the sticker on the sticker on the phone. People pull out their phone, like, dude, where can I get a sticker? Right. You know what I mean? It's like <clears throat> they become your walking advertisement. Right. You know, so like basically you did that. You're like, okay, there's a window. Why don't I just turn that into my walking advertisement? And that's when people started putting me on their their thing. You know, they're like, who's the man who does? And then what got better was like, uh, people were people from my residence were like, oh, that's my Don. Uh huh. I was gonna get the bike, but 
Yeah, screw the bike. Yeah, whatever. All right, fine. All right, okay. Yeah. Uh, they're like, oh, that's my Dylan. And then that's when it was like, oh, who's that? Arvel. And I'm like, oh, shit. And that's when um, my boss was like, do you have something on your window? That's when oh, that's when. And you're like, uh oh. I was like, yeah. And he's like, good. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, that's the worst. And you're like, uh. Um, yeah. He's like, do you have something maybe? on your window? Because someone's like, because I started getting, like, people were talking. Like, I got two two people on their, on their window uh-huh. putting out, we subscribed. Nice. Or like, we um, subscribe. That's awesome sick. channel. Yeah. Awesome YT channel. I was like, oh shit. That's cool. That's cool. Yeah. Uh, the second thing for marketing was uh, it was me and Caitlin were like, yo, every time we post something on YouTube on Instagram because we're trying to up ourselves on Instagram. Yeah. Um, no one, no one really likes it. You need bots though, man. Like the secret behind that is like. You no, I know. I saw that bots. too. Yeah. I guess I saw that. Like, pay fifty dollars for this. I'm like, mm, yeah, don't do that. Well, don't need that. I use it for. It's for businesses. Like, if you have like a physical business, then. Yeah, I assume I you it. you did it for. Uh, companies. Yeah, for companies. Okay. But I, I don't like it's it's weird when you do it for like yourself because then because, people can yeah. tell they're like, why are you liking that random? Exactly. Photo? Yeah. But um, the way I did it was just like, hey, check out our videos. I just took a screenshot of like our channel with all of the videos all sure, open, yeah. clicked mm-hmm. all and all of that. And then um, I posted it and I noticed it only got like 49 likes. I'm like, oh, nice. okay. And then me and Caitlin, Caitlin put her, her photo on about like, oh, we got 150 subscribers. Did you see that picture? Yeah, yeah I saw that. Yeah, yeah, where she just made like a little thing and then she po- she, she sat in the, in front of the, yeah. um, she sat in front of the. You have to kill all these people, bro. Oh really? Yeah. Get ready. Yeah. Okay. All right. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Uh, how do I get a gun out again? There you go. Cool. Come on. Yeah. Um. So she, we realized that how do we get more likes? Uh-huh. And um, we get more likes whenever we're in the pictures. Yeah. Like a for person sure. is in the picture. Yeah. So uh, so Caitlin was like, okay. So we tested it out with her account. Uh huh. And she got a bunch of she got like a hundred something. No way. One hundred fifty wow. likes about. Yeah. about getting 150 subscribers right yeah. so it's like oh, okay so people are actually looking at it. so because what i was thinking is if they if there's not that many likes that means people are just swiping up they're just not not looking at it right right but um and then i was like oh that's a good idea so then when i got my second camera uh-huh. i decided to be like oh say cheese with the two cameras and then put hashtag sad turnips and yeah. then that got more likes then i was like oh and then i noticed that the subscriber count went up so i was I, like mm. i find it's usually achievements you know what i mean like, yeah like if you like so I'll, I'll do like a quote of the day or something but it won't get that much mm-hmm. but then the people who react to it they'll comment about it you know what I mean? it's like a lot of people just swipe like uh, swipe past it yeah you know but then if it's like if it's something cool like like i, I put like tara's birthday today and then um people are like liking it hardcore but it's like oh it's an achievement you know people yeah. people feel like oh empathically you know like i'm not trying to sell you anything i'm like you you know i find that like a lot of um uh, one of one of our cousins, she's like friends with a band guy. Like he's he's getting pretty famous. Uh, junior Junior hashtag Junior Junior. Um, shout out, sorry. And then um, she was saying that like, junior oh, it's junior. really nice now that he's like talking about his OCD, you know, as like an illness. Blah blah blah. blah. Okay. I'm like, yeah, that's just his technique to like market. It's like I'm like one of you guys. Yeah. Like love me because I'm I'm a normal person. But yeah. it's like. That in itself is a marketing tactic. Mm-hmm. You weren't actually trying to tell people, like, <clears throat> you know, why are you making music then? You should be, like, pioneering, championing, like, um, anti ocd Yeah. So, you know what I mean? Like, it's, it, it seems disingenuous to a marketer, myself, because, like, I kind of feel like it's a tactic, you know? But it, it's almost like what you're doing with your thing because it's a tactic, too, you know? It's like people. Because mm-hmm. people like people. And stuff, people like people. Know? Yeah, for sure. So, uh, yeah, any other tricks? Uh, so well, I mean the upcoming one, right? Oh, why this did you get in the, the back passenger seat, seat yo? All right, guy. Um, oh my goodness! The trunk. What's going on right now? Whoa, what's going on right now? There was triangle. There it is. Oh, that didn't happen. Yo, I don't understand. Okay, deliver it to the business. All right, you have to steal a different car. Oh, there you go. All right, continue. Yeah. <clears throat> Putting that, uh, the the upcoming one right now, uh, is the is that the sticker idea? Oh yeah, yeah. Oh, and that's that's, that's genius one too one. because like people love free stuff. Oh and yeah. Then, like if you have like an ad on the sticker, mm-hmm. it's like it'll it'll force people to check things out, you know. And like um, it, it uh, apparently it's 
Oh, just yesterday, uh -huh. uh, we had a, a resident who was who was leaving to go to a Halloween party, uh -huh. and he like he's, he he wasn't from our residence, but uh -huh. um, he he saw me uh, with a camera because I was videoing something on because we had an event yesterday about consent, so okay. we just had like yeah. a consent board. It said consent, and then um, people are just writing random stuff on it, it's just uh -huh. like that kind of thing. And then I was videoing it because my like, alright, let's put this in the video. I was just panning like this, and yeah. then I got pushed like this. I was like, yo, what's up? And then he's just like, are you sad turnips? And I'm like, oh, no, no way. way. That's <laughs> no sick. Way. Yeah. yeah. He's like, are you sad turnips? I'm like, yeah. He's like, this is such an honor. I'm like, what wow. is going on right now? But you know, you know what's crazy, though? It's like, so I, I knew for you it would be a lot easier to blow up than if you were in, like, the real world. Because, like, if you're in, not, I don't, because I don't, you're in the real world. But, I mean, like, uh, you have a microcosm at your hands, right? You have, like, the university. Right. And people are like, you know, they're all trying to like big each other up and mm -hmm. stuff. It's it's a little more difficult without an automatic network because you're presented with one. You're you're presented with an audience all the time. Mm -hmm. you know, so that's why I'm like, take advantage now so that once you leave university, it's like you'll have that entire following following you mm -hmm. into the future. You know what I mean? Uh, let's let's do one more because I like this topic. All right, cool. cool. Um, so, all right, so. Uh, Oh, what, what I find, so like, I thought you were going to say this, but you didn't end up saying it, but it's uh, network effects is a huge one. So like, if you somehow uh, connect, so like, what I find is like, um, you'll, if you film something for someone else, then they're going to want to put it up. And then if they put it up or share it, that creates a network effect onto you. You know, it's like dominoes. Which is also why I, I believe that how to get big is you just put people on your vlogs because they yeah, just, for people sure. just want to see themselves. Oh, and people, true, true, people, yo, that's pretty sneaky, yo. People project themselves, like once they're in a video, they'll be like, yo, check me out, I'm in a video. Wow, you you know that in saying that, you've just recorded this as, and that's like, your mark, and then you're like, dude, you're just doing that thing that you said. What? No, no, but yeah, you were saying people, that that is a big thing. That's kind of why Casey. Uh, I'm sure that's why Casey blew up too, because like he'd show his fans. That's, but that's know? the reason why, like, like every time I see it now, like even Ellen, Ellen puts all of these famous people. Why oh, do you for think sure, she's yeah. Putting people on there? Of course, yeah, exactly. That's Casey why whenever Ellen. whenever like people make videos even on YouTube, uh -huh. they're like, oh, today I hung out with Justin Bieber. For sure, yeah, it's for, sure, for sure. It's yeah, like, oh, yeah, I hung out with yeah, them. true, true, true. I'm just telling people the, the, what's what's up. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Actually, yeah, it's but but it's not like. It's interesting because like one could see it as like uh, negative or like stepping stones, but it's really not like, it's not really like that. It's like the ones who will rise to the surface will rise to the surface. Mm -hmm. You know, it's like, I'm like, we, we think of ourselves as like individual units within life, but we're not really built that way. You know what I mean? Individual units of life. No, so, we're all together. Exactly. So it's like, it's like <clears throat> in me putting you on my cool. video, um, you would have been in my life either way. You know, right. what I mean? like you would have walked past that person either way, but you put them on the video, just giving them a bit of acknowledgement mm -hmm. that they're going to be in the video, and then they will appreciate it by subscribing or liking. You know, yep. so it's like it's not really a negative thing. Like that's one of the things that people say, like, "Oh, marketing's so evil," but it's not really. It's making you all connected. Yeah, yeah. Or actually, let, let me ask you about this one. So, how do you feel about? So, this was a big controversy when I was studying it in school. And <clears> like, <throat> um, oh, stop sign. Well, nice. where am I right now? Oh, you gotta go to the back. Oh. Yo, that's... Keep on, yeah. Yeah, Are you sure? Yeah, this yeah, is yeah, an airport. Yeah, it's in the airport. It's in the very back there. I feel like I'm gonna get shot, yo. Yeah, you probably will. Actually, don't do that. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. All right, go around, go around. Yeah. All right, cool. Uh, so, um, so I find that, like... Uh, oh, no, no, so, so the biggest controversy was that um, they're stealing our data. What do you mean? So, like, if I... You know what cookies are? Yeah, I know what cookies are, but I don't know what they do. Uh, they make you fat. Oh. No, I thought you were no, no, talking no. about computer cookies. Yeah, of course, computer cookies. <laughs> All right, so computer cookies, uh, they, they, like, they track your history and stuff, right? And in doing that, if you go to something like Amazon, uh, it will show you related ads to like sell you stuff. Mm -hmm. So do you think that's like a breach of privacy or do you think that's like um, a good thing? Uh, the breach of privacy, like whatever you, you search up, they know? Yeah, and then they'll target advertising towards you. I mean, that's the same thing with, like, the good and bad, right? For sure, yeah. Okay. It has a positive and negative, but, like, personally, for me, I don't really care. 
Exactly. Yeah, yeah. So like, a lot of people are like, no, I like my privacy. Blah blah blah. blah. And but I'll, I mean, like nowadays, especially right now, especially with technology, like, what are you really trying to be private? Like, the, you when you post something on Instagram, the world sees it. When you post something on YouTube, the world sees it. When you use your credit card, they see it. Yeah. See that? That's what I'm it's saying. All it's connected like, already. It, it's like. It's like you can you can run from it, or you can just embrace the fact and utilize it to your advantage. I, yeah, I feel like they they say like people who run from it they have something to hide. Mm -hmm. I don't know if that's the truth. Like it could just be like broken down to it could be true, but it could just be broken down to like a genuine fear. Yeah, and but um, of being watched all the time. But I mean, yo, yeah. like I know there's all there's another argument with like yo even even walking on the street you're not. Like exactly. They have, they have cameras on you. Exactly. Exactly. So you're not just gonna go outside. Like, yeah. What's what's going on? You know what I mean? Just just like you understand it. Don't be scared of the world, man. It's already there. Exactly, yo. Um, they uh, there's a great uh, conversation between Joe Rogan and uh, Russell Brand, and he was saying like a lot of people will hide away from society, you know, okay. but like the monks in like the the mountains and stuff, but mm -hmm. they don't realize that society's just going on without you. You're yeah. Just, like, yeah. Yourself, like, <laughs> Like, what are you going to change, It's bro? like time. It's just moving on, man. It's just like, moving whatever. on, yo. You're going to die. Exactly, exactly. And, like, uh, so I feel like that's, like, with this technology, the only thing that I really like about this technology is there's some things that I search up, but I can't find anything for. But then, like, I'll get an ad on Instagram, and I'm like, oh, totally, that's exactly what I was looking for. That's so funny. You know what I mean? Like, yeah. do you find that? Like, yeah. Like, I, I was looking for um, these, like, leather watches. Oh, and, yeah, 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 yeah. Um, and on Amazon, Where and I couldn't it? find any. And then it was on Instagram. It was like, oh, buy a leather watch strap mm. for your Apple. And here I was like, thank That's you. So I was funny. like, looking for it, bro. Yeah, so it's convenient. Yeah, it totally, totally. As long as you understand and respect the rules of the game. How do I zoom out, yo? Uh, I don't know. Zoom Gonna go there. Yeah, and then, pro yeah, okay, cool, cool. There it is. Yeah, awesome. Oh, that was quite far. Okay. That's what I'm saying, yo. That was so far. Oh, no, you're kind of on the path. It's whatever. Yeah, so uh, you are saying? You were finding something? Oh, yeah, yeah. So, yeah, I found the same thing when um, I was into, like, finding my camera. Yeah. Right? Um, I, and the road, road mic and everything yeah, like yeah. that. Um, I, when I searched that up once, uh -huh. or just, just like, a casual 10, 10 minutes while, like, I was on the washer. Uh, taking <laughs> shit. Um, when I finished, uh, I was on YouTube. I got an ad for cameras. Oh, dude. Oh, my God. <clears throat> no, no. Like, all right. Yeah, I, I, he's totally, totally. I, I get where you're going with this one. But this will mind blow you. This, I don't know. I was like, how did you guys figure this one out? Right. So, okay. So, I went to the store, right? I went to the Metro right beside my okay. apartment. And I was like, all right, man, what coffee will I buy? I don't know if this was, like, actually them tracking me or it's, like, 2020 hindsight. I made the connection myself. But, like, I bought this uh, coffee brand I've never tried before called Lavazza because it was on sale. And it tasted amazing. So I made myself a cup. I was like, this is the sickest coffee ever. Okay. I literally turned on my YouTube and there's the commercial for Lavazza. I'm like, bro, did you track my Is this them telling card? you? We got you, yo. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I'm laughing in my face, yo. But, like, how did that work, you know? Okay, well, um, there's also the whole idea, like, you you have to remember that it was on sale, right? So for sure, yeah. So maybe they've been promoting it. That's what I'm thinking, too. It's like... Um, <clears throat> everything's being said at all the times but it's like your mind's not filtering it out right because you're not like it's like if you're going to the dentist soon you're going to see dentist places all over right you know yeah but, yeah, yeah yeah but it was just weird timing that i was like i never tried the brand mm. before and then when i go on it it's like oh i just saw the commercial right <laughs> and now. was that good oh it's really good yeah what shout out of? lavaza lavaza sponsor me because i love coffee, <laughs> Lots uh, of coffee. Yeah, <laughs> sponsor him so i can just like take some that's right yeah coffee, coffee. so uh yeah so um, do you, do you, I actually find like that kind of marketing is really good. Which one? Uh, so like Walmart will do something similar where, you know, when they, you check out and they're like, will you give us your postal code? Yeah. So the reason behind that is they track what people buy within specific postal codes. So if you go from one Walmart to another mm. Walmart, it's going to have different things. Yeah. Yeah. And the reason why it has different things is because, uh, it's the trying to, different. yeah, the demographic's different. So if I didn't give is them my the postal right? code, yeah, that's the one. Are you sure? Uh, mm. Maybe not, actually. It could not be. Maybe I think it's this, yo. It's this bike. Oh, it's... It could be that bike. It's the bike. It's the oh, okay. Sweet, sweet, sweet. Good, good. So, yeah. If I hadn't given them my postal code, I would have not had... So, like, there's carrot juice, right? I love... I drink carrot Where's juice. Where's this going, yo? Uh, like, the back alley? Should I go that way? Yeah, just follow it. Whatever. Uh, if anyone's ever played GTA, uh, we're following the... The map. The map right now. The map, the highlighted yellow that's telling me where to go. and like, why did dearth pass? Whatever. probably faster Whatever. so um so like uh i i drink carrot juice right and like really yeah, yeah. so juice. like if i don't 
So I find that like I actually have to travel to like three different Walmarts to find the carrot juice. And like I'm in Morningside, there's no carrot juice. I'm like, oh, probably because like nobody in this, mm, this area the drinks area. it. So I have to go find a place where where it will sell. You know what I mean? Yeah. It, it's better for Walmart to find out this. So like it's a two way street, right? Walmart gets to lower its costs by yep. figuring out where it needs to ship mm-hmm. things, so it's not wasting anything. And two, I get better things served to me in my area if I buy it within that area. Yeah. So embrace. You're embracing it. For sure. For sure. I I really don't see a problem marketing. Yeah. So, uh, what do you think about um, what do you think about anti privacy? What do you mean anti privacy? I don't know. I was just trying to throw out a topic there. But yeah, I thought we already discussed this, like just now. Like, I was gonna say Trump, privacy. but I was like, you know, that's <laughs> as my like default. Trump? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh man, I hear this. I hear a lot about this guy. A Actually, lot. let's not talk about him because like he. Yeah. There's a big chance of like. Yeah. Retaliation. That's fine. Yeah. That's fair. Trump, Trump. Could anything. you could you imagine like being so like there's no prerequisite to being a uh, president or no no there's there's a huge prerequisite to being president I mean like there's no prerequisite to being an adult right? yeah hundred percent like you're just gonna grow up regardless right yeah so it's like but knowing this like I was just sound like airy fairy but it's totally not your consciousness does not change consciousness is basically awareness the way right? you think will not change exactly that's what you're trying to say. yeah the way you think's not gonna change you're still gonna think through innocence whatever whatever you may become jaded but that's just gonna like alter it but you're gonna feel the same way you're gonna feel like yeah. the sense of like i'm the only one in this <sighs> world right and it yeah. could sound airy fairy but um in school we call that habitus oh interesting okay habitus thank is you another Phil word Wilson. habitus is, is basically you saying conscious it's basically um is it pronounced habitus habitus yeah or is it habitus habitus is what i keep hearing okay from the prof from prof okay cool um, yeah, so habitus from from our prof is um, just something like how do you spell that? H a b i t u s. It could be habitus. Habit habitus. Habitus, habitus bro. It, but, but they say habitus. But okay. I think it's because a French guy developed oh, it. Oh, like uh, may we? Yeah, I get what you're saying. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'm pretty sure it's a habitus. I mean, and that's habitus how I used to say it. Freaking fake, yo. Habitus. Habitus. Whatever. Yeah. Sorry. Habitus is just telling you like uh, the way you were raised. The way you, what was ever around you, your influences, that's how you're going to, dic- that dictates the rest of your life. Oh, that's like life. behavioralism. Yeah. Or right. your consciousness. That's how your consciousness develops. Oh, it's how it develops. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, so like. Through heavy twos. Right, right, right. But, but at the center of it, you're still conscious. So consciousness is the ability to become conscious of something. Right, you're just aware of something. Right? Oh, I see what you're saying. Happy Tooth is more of like this is a subconscious. Thing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Um, like why you make your decisions, blah blah blah. blah. Mm-hmm. But like, so the consciousness will stay the same, right? So like, I I can become conscious of something. I know hey, it hurts your back just sitting for so long. I sit all day, and it's like, mm-hmm. oh. If you so, heard that, that was a shout out to my back. Yeah, crack crack. Neck, Air bubbles yeah. now. So um, so that being said, it's like, could you imagine being somebody in a position of power, like not saying Trump, <clears throat> but like somebody like Trump and it's like you're just getting all this like hate hate mm. you know texts and like like what's that got to do to your consciousness right 100 you know you're like so right now you're getting like oh man you're like the sad turnus guy that's awesome what if it like totally changed like i freaking hate you yeah you're like oh god i've had I've, I've well i haven't had that yet but i mean there was that one guy oh mr uh go on uh just like spree or no no the <laughs> i don't one. know i don't know who, who who disliked it oh okay but they went on all my videos and just disliked it i was like oh okay yeah how'd that make you feel I mean, did, at, did it oh, make your self worth feel lower? No. Whoa. Did you? One hundred percent. Like um, at first, because it was like, I remember um, hearing a lot of YouTubers before when I oh. didn't make YouTube. Yeah. When they were like, "Oh man, I hate it when people dislike it because it's my hard work and stuff." Yeah, 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 yeah But I'm sure. like, yo, but that's gonna happen. So for like, sure, for sure. I, actually, it, it's funny you're talking about this. Like, I got this this pro tip from Joe Rogan. He's like, as soon as I get a hater, I just block and delete them. Yeah, you know what I mean, like, dude. Yeah. I, I just do that in my life now. You know? Yeah, like, me nah, too. Ever since you told me that, yo. Yeah, you don't need Lock that, it. right? It's you like, know, oh, no, nah, yo. Like the world's big, yo. Go find somebody else to pick mm-hmm. on. You know what I mean? And like, um, but so like, but it's only a problem when like you're you're connected through a network. So like, sometimes I'll get like a hater who I know through another person, and it's like you just want to delete them because you're like, all right, man. But like, what I'll do is I'll just like I'll give them a thumbs up or like like their post when they hate. But it's like, yeah, I want to. Um, I want to just block and bleed them, but sometimes you can't, man. That's the problem with like living in a society that's like connected. Oh, and this is what you're talking about, like the the privacy thing. You can't get away from it now. 
Uh, kind of. I really just brought up privacy because I was trying to fill in another topic. Oh, okay. During that. Was that filled? Pause. Was it filled? It was filled. That was actually quite good. Okay, good. So uh, we are now going to end the podcast as I must head back to my old stomping grounds. And I have to go back to York University. Yeah. Um, so subscribe to Sad Turnips on YouTube. They actually have a URL. Uh, yeah, we have a URL at uh, youtube.com forward slash sad turnips. Uh, and check out this podcast on iTunes. Oh, uh, so if you're listening to this, don't just listen to it. Like and rate it, please. No, no, please. You don't have to do anything. I don't care what you do. But like, if you would like to spread a bit of positivity, like and rate it because uh, you need like ranks to go up in iTunes. So if you like what we're saying and you want to support, this is how you support the most maximum way. Well, or you can just give us money through Patreon. That's another one. Yeah, but that's that's cash money. This one will take like two seconds every day. Although time is money, so it's up to you. I don't really care, but I do care. No, I really don't care actually. Hashtag Sagrada Gamers. All right, peace out. Peace, peace.